Hi guys, so this is a Nerf long shot I bought on Taobao. This, uh, it's not an ordinary long shot, obviously. The seller claims that it has Explorer internals, which is really valuable. So now let's see, let's find out, right? Uh, first of all, let's just open the shell. Anyways, just t take these things off. No screws. That's really nice. First, we remove this stock. There isn't a stock block, so I don't know if he has modded the springs or not. Because it, it, the blaster can be quite dangerous and it might be it might hurt your hands if you don't use a stop block and you're using very, very powerful springs. Oh well, he says that he has orange mount works triggers here. Is it metal? And these stuff I receive are basically in pieces. So I had to assemble them again. How to do this? Oh. Okay, so another screw here. Hopefully there isn't any other screws or it will be a waste of time to try to take them all off. This screw is, those screws are quite large. Let's open the show up. Do we have to first remove this? How do we actually remove this? Is there any help? Any tools? No. Interesting. Oh, screws on top. Doesn't help. This is very interesting. Okay, uh, th that's, I guess we're first. We probably won't be able to open the shell. Uh, it doesn't go together. Okay. So this is the boat action kit. I think it's by worker. If those internals are really nice, I probably can get them into a X suit or something. Seller packed everything very carefully. So guys, I'm sorry for the chaos on the workshop. I'm going to clean it up really soon because there are a lot of those adhesive that I are using for the birthday project. But anyways, as we have already seen, when we open the shell of this blaster, it has a, I think, genuine explorer set, the X-Power kit. We can see, see that by the 
the, the tip of the plunder razor entirely metal and this thing and this barrel the aluminum breech I think really resembles uh, those on the picture of on like, the official website of Explorer so I'm just going to believe that it really is and this is of course a worker pump action kit why did I use those tapes here because I found out there's there's a very big flaw about a lot of workers 3d printed stuff that you can't really get those screws into into the other part of the 3d printed plastic because it just makes a flaw in the middle and makes it bigger and bigger so I just use those tapes uh, it affects how you feel when you hold it a little bit but it's still functional so I think that's what count and what's enough for me and you, you, you can actually can prime this multiple times like two to three times in chamber two to three darts and use because the air seal is absolutely perfect you can use that to just fire two or three darts at the very same time and that's just awesome and about the stock it used to be this one but because the spring is too powerful every time you prime it, it collapses automatically and it might injure something and I haven't found out a way because I don't think there's a guide about those trigger what you call the stock block mechanism so I just directly bought one from worker that's quite cool not as functional because it does it cannot carry a magazine but it's quite cool and it fits with the worker f10555 here and here and on its back so I think before I do the paint job I'm just going to keep this on so as you can see it hits really really hard and to demonstrate how hard it hits we must go to fire test now 